Hello, 219 Tiger here, and I'm sure by now you have saw the title of this video, and I've kind of wondered what's going on, and why am I leaving Instagram, and when I joined Instagram, I wanted to make new friends. Um, I was lonely, and <clears throat> I wanted to meet new people. Um, want to make new friends because I spend 99.9 .9 of my time alone and I thought it would be nice to be able to make new friends you know have people to talk to I've always wanted an internet friend um, but as time has progressed I've started to realize how toxic Instagram really is. And how some people who I thought were my friends are werewolf in sheep's clothing, as Anna would put it. And just a lot of things. And It kind of hurts me, you know. Um, <clears throat> there's been some recent incidents that have kind of made me kind of um, make, make me made me feel like absolute shit. Um, there's certain people I'm not gonna name who they are um, that have made me feel like absolute shit. Um, I've had my eating disorder uh, triggered. Um, I had somebody attack me, be, you know, because, judge me because I wasn't, uh, you know, 100% vegan. Um, I don't eat a lot of red meat. I've never been a big fan of meat, quite honestly. Um, <clears throat> I have a eating, you know, Obviously, I've posted videos about my eating disorder, but this person, you you know, pretty much jumped on me. You should, uh, you should, uh, you should become vegan. You need to become vegan. And it's, look, I have an eating disorder. Food's already in it, you know what I mean? I don't need people nitpicking what I eat. And as a, a friend, and you know I have an eating disorder. That hurts. And. It almost makes me feel like sometimes. I'm not even good enough to be a friend. Like I mean I feel like there's some people. That act like I'm almost not good enough to be their friend. I've had. One constant person. That has actually. Tried to get to know me. And has been there. And that's Rita. Who is... Who... Will message me. How are you doing today? Are you okay? Do you need to talk? Who actually... Tries to be my friend. And has tried... And attempted to get to know me. I don't care about likes on my photos. I'm not one of these, oh my god, you don't like my photos. So you know, I'm not one of these people. <clears throat> I'm more of the front aspect. And there's some people that I've trusted and I made that mistake of trusting them and it's backfired. And I've started to learn more and more that there's a lot of, there's a lot of there's a lot of werewolves in sheep's clothing, so to speak. And it's made me depressed. It's made me not want to eat. It's gotten to the point where it's gotten like I get sent self harming uh, photos at best. Not, not to be sent. I constantly get them. And 
it's just like I feel like I've sat here and I, I'm a very understanding person like I don't get upset easily like I'm one of these people that I completely understand like I mean I'm one of these people that I don't blow I don't get mad and I don't blow up over small things and you know I've never been one of them that did them. I've always been an understanding person because I've always put myself in that person's shoes, you know. And I feel like you know, like like I stated my last video, I used to feel like I was close to a lot of the sunflowers. Now we don't. I don't even talk to any of them anymore. Hardly. It's like you know, and I I've just gotten. Old. It's just, I don't, it feels even more lonely. And I mean, and, and <clears throat> I've had people tell me the reason why they don't, why they don't have Instagram pages. Like I got some people that I know that, that don't have Instagram pages because they said, you know, why would you want to go out a page where people show how wonderful their life is and your life is, is, is falling apart. And I've started the re- think about that I mean I like showing my photos I like taking pictures um, I like posting stuff that I can relate to <laughs> you know I post a lot of stuff I can relate to or stuff I agree with and I, I don't always expect everybody to agree with me you know what I mean I don't I'm not one of these people I don't want to argue with people I, don't, I hate arguments but like I'll debate you know if it's worth it, you know what I mean? Because I do respect other people's opinions. I really do. Like, I mean, you know, but I've had people like flat out attack me. I've had people tell me to kill myself constantly. I've, I've, I've thought about leaving Instagram permanently. But then again, I still like posting pictures on it. And I think a lot of it is that I need to kind of step away and reevaluate because I'm starting to realize as it goes on, it's gotten completely and utterly toxic. And it's become a lonely place. Um, And it's sad when the people you thought you can count on, and the people you thought cared about you, and you thought you know, and who you generally really did think were your friends, turn out they're really not. And I've started to realize that, and it's made me feel even more lonely. Um, <clears throat> I will still post on my YouTube. I have, I have an Instagram that's definitely set up for my YouTube page. Um, so people on Instagram can know when, if they if they care, can know when my videos are up. I almost feel like I can't trust anybody anymore. Um, it's made me want to recoil back into myself again and regress back into myself again because people kind of don't think about other, other people's feelings at all like we treat each other like garbage sometimes and I think that's the problem with this world is we don't stop and we don't think and we don't take that time out to, under, to understand where that person's coming from. And, like, I've been the type of person, like, if you need me, I'm there. And, I've stayed up sometimes past my bedtime to talk somebody out of taking their life. I've done that multiple times. I don't brag about it, but, because as a friend, that's what you do. As a good person, that's what you do. But a lot of times when I've needed people, nobody's there. 
a lot of the times. And I feel like sometimes I don't get the effort that I put in. I feel like sometimes I, 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 I try to get to know people. I try to be their friend. And I feel like almost like, you know, sometimes it's like, yeah, okay, you're my friend, but not really, you know. You're, you're across the pond. I, you, you don't matter. Um, <clears throat> so I think it's almost to the point where I almost feel like I got to start. I'm going to have to go back to keeping everybody putting the brick wall back up and keeping everybody at arm's length because it's getting to that point that I feel like it's just me, myself, and I. And that you really can't count on anybody. And that's the saddest part of everything. Is that you can't. And I know a lot of people are going to say, well, what do you expect? It's an online platform. People are there to make friends. And that's fine. You, you may be right. You know. You, you know. So, I think if I do come back, and I don't know when, I'm, I don't know when or if I'm going to come back, um, I'm probably not going to be talking to a whole lot of people. Um, it's just, there's no point. I've tried to let people in, I've let people in. I've been made a fool of. Um, It's just I feel like uh, sometimes it's just like I'm not good enough. And maybe I'm not. Maybe, maybe I'm not. Maybe I'm, I, you know, I, I would think I'm not a horrible person, but... You know, I think maybe I I I don't know. Maybe I expect too much. I don't know. Um, I start you know being a friend is, is being there for you, for each other. But I guess I'm maybe I'm wrong. Um, but yeah, this is so. This is why, like, I'm, I'm gonna leave Instagram. Um, there's times where I've actually left Inst- Instagram and I've realized nobody's even noticed. So, people probably won't notice I'm gone. Oh, well, I know Rita probably will. Um, and Rita, if you see this video, I love you. You've been the one constant friend in my life that's actually been there and has actually been the true definition of a friend um with that I'm gonna end this video um I will be posting Friday uh, going back to my regular schedule um I have a pretty interesting video planned for the next uh, video. But until uh, I see you next time, stay strong, stay lucid, remember love is louder, please be kind to each other. Because you never know what somebody truly is going through. See you guys next video.